In a fast-moving and increasingly competitive world, Denso is ever ready to embrace new horizons, surpass the competition and offer more products for its customers while continuing to uphold the values we believe in. Our values are our promises to our customers. Quality assurance, innovation, technological advancement, extensive network, eco-friendliness and enhancing social values. In the short span of 56 years, an international network of 115 companies was established in more than 31 countries. With a global staff strength of more than 104,000 associates and an annual turnover of 26.2 billion US dollars, Denso continues to serve the world's major car makers with dedication, quality and reliability. In 1995, Denso International Singapore Private Limited, or DISP, started operations in the Mendel at Science Park One. With a modest staff strength of eight, DISP was set up to meet the growing demand for the automotive industry in the Asia-Pacific and to manage aftermarket activities for products such as spark plugs, oil filters and the engineering and development of bus air conditioners. Even before DISP was set up, Denso was already involved in a demonstration project for the Electronic Road Pricing System or ERP in Singapore. Denso started developing the ERP project in Singapore with the Public Works Department, now known as the Land Transport Authority in 1992. We are proud to have accomplished the project together and gained invaluable experience from Singapore which we brought back to Japan. Besides developing the electronic toll collection system, we've also expanded our use of information technology to develop advanced vehicle operation, car navigation and communication systems in various markets. Our products have also gradually become a part of the daily lives of most Singaporeans. Public bus companies have brought comfort to their commuters by using Denso's bus aircon units since 1997. In 1998, Denso International Asia Private Limited was established as a holding company for the region and also acted as the functional headquarters of the region. One year later, we expanded into a 2,200 square meter office in Science Park 2, employing about 70 associates. It was also during this time that the Materials Technical Center was set up. Its main function was to verify the quality of raw materials from suppliers in this region and to improve the technology for the development of raw materials. One such example is the air conditioning condenser, which has been greatly improved in design and performance over the years. It is with the technology developed together with our suppliers that Denso was able to produce condenser tubes with 21 holes. Tube thickness was reduced by 70% resulting in a much higher cooling efficiency. The MTC also promoted local procurement of raw materials in the region so that materials can be obtained at a lower cost. With the help of our reliable and dependable suppliers, materials localization has increased to 80% in 2005. At Denso, we continually seek ways to increase cost efficiency for our customers. After the ASEAN Free Trade Area was established in 2002, Denso actively promoted the export of products by different countries. As a result, we were able to lower our production costs and enjoy greater product efficiency. Through complementation, our group companies are able to concentrate the production on certain products, then export to plants in other countries. By doing so, every company will have their core products to complement each other. So in this way, we will help to reduce the cost for our production, at the same time, streamline the operation. By 2004, our export and import complementation has been increased to $400 million and our export ratio has also increased to 24%. As a result of complementation and volume production, we are able to reduce the cost of our products, 
thereby increasing cost competitiveness for our valued customers. In 2002, Denso Singapore introduced a two-way plastic returnable box scheme across countries to deliver automotive parts within the ASEAN region. The scheme reduces wastage of traditional carton boxes which do not withstand weather and other natural elements. The J-front boxes can be recycled and reused over time, thereby increasing cost efficiency. More importantly, we can become more environment friendly and play our part as a responsible global corporate citizen. Singapore's strong infrastructure as a commercial and business hub also positions the country as the ideal location to set up our Finance Treasury Centre, or in short, FTC. Established in 2000, the FTC coordinates all activities related to cash management, investment and funding for the region. Through our activities, we help the regional group companies to save time and money on banking and risk management work so they can focus better on their core manufacturing business. As Denso's business continues to grow globally, it's important for us to understand and establish close relationships with our partners from different parts of the world. As such, the Human Resource Department conducts regular intercultural training for our associates. By 2005, 272 associates have undergone the training, equipping them with a global outlook that transcends all cultures. Technical training programs are also held regularly for our associates to keep abreast of the latest developments and technology in the industry. Besides in-house training, our associates also take up professional enrichment courses in established institutions such as the Singapore Institute of Management. Since our establishment in 1995, Denso Singapore has grown steadily over the past 10 years. Serving 25 countries in Asia and the Middle East in 1995, we've now expanded into North Africa and extended our sales and service network to cover 30 countries. As part of our expansion plans, we've also set up our first joint venture company in Saudi Arabia to manufacture aircon kits. To help our partners enjoy greater time and cost savings, the Regional Logistics Centre was set up in 2003. By consolidating the supplies, our delivery lead time is dramatically reduced from two months to 10 days for our customers. In addition, customers' inventory risks and holding costs are reduced, affirming Denso's commitment to all our customers' needs. Despite Denso's growth and continuing drive towards technical excellence, we believe in striking a good balance between work and play. Denso is proud to be supporting the Singapore Japanese Rugby Football Club for the past five years. We are pleased to be playing friendly matches with the Singapore Recreation Club. Through rugby, we have established much closer ties with them. We have been playing against Singapore Japanese Rugby Football Club for two years. The team is very committed and passionate and this makes them worthy opponents. In a fast-changing society, staying ahead has been a key factor in Denso's continued success in the industry. Denso's plans for the future will ensure that the company remains competitive, adaptable and forward-looking. With our overriding desire to bring consideration and fulfilment to the global society, we remain committed to the Denso Vision 2015 to contribute to a better world with products that show our concern for the environment, safety, comfort and convenience. We want to go beyond all expectations of our customers and the global society. Denso! With your support, we will continue to turn the ideas for tomorrow's global automotive industry into a reality today.